The gift of instant fire seems to convince the Tulambi that Dutilleu, living dead or not, is socially acceptable, or at least is no immediate threat. With what may be one of the oldest gestures of humankind, the right hand, the weapon hand, is offered in greeting. It seems like the Tulambi have never seen a white man, and that they're finally prepared to believe their own eyes. And Gio seems most eager to continue to communicate with Jean-Pierre, to show them how they live. Uh -uh. Can I see the bag? Uh -uh. Uh -huh. uh -uh. Dutilleux and his team spent three days with the Tulambi. They must return to their people, and it's time for the members of the expedition to do the same. After the Tulambi had dressed for their journey, they began to sing a farewell song. ومن آياته of his miracles اختلاف ألسنتكم وألوانكم that you have different languages and you have different skin colors explicitly Allah mentions this is of my design this is of my intention I made you different amongst yourselves but why لتعارفوا لتعارفوا تعارف means to get to know one another from the Muslim perspective from the Quranic perspective we're supposed to have respect for different races just because Allah called races themselves, different colors of skin themselves, a divine sign, a sign of Himself, a reminder of Himself. So when people look at a, the, the color of skin and consider someone inferior or superior or a hated race or a loved race, then that itself is a denial of the ayat of Allah. So read all the places in the Quran where Allah says those who disbelieve in our ayat, those who disregard our ayat, those who don't care about our ayat, those who lie against our ayat, those who you know, don't consider our ayat, then this is the ayat too. A person's skin is an ayat too. And you don't respect a person who's a different skin than you, you are disregarding an ayat of Allah. What a powerful teaching of the Quran. What a powerful way to combat racism. So how can you call yourself a Muslim and you have racist tendencies? How can you do that? وَمِنْ آيَاتِهِ خَلْقُ السَّمَاوَاتِ وَالْأَرْضِ وَاخْتِلَافُ أَلْسِنَتِكُمْ وَأَلْوَانِكُمْ إِنَّ فِي ذَلِكَ لَا آيَاتٍ In that there are many, many, many miracles, many signs, many teachings, many paths to guidance for people who actually know. لِلْعَالِمِينَ So what are we learning? People who are racist and still call themselves Muslims can't possibly be knowledgeable. Oh, oh, oh.